Hello children, today we are going to learn a very interesting topic in our lesson, Sensory Organs. Children, let us learn about overcoming disability. If a part of our body does not function well, we face many difficulties. If our eyes do not function well, we cannot see properly. If our ears do not work as they should, we cannot hear well. In such a situation, our movements are not smooth. We find it difficult to do things on our own. But such situation can be overcome. Some disabilities can be corrected by medical treatment. In some matters, we can take the help of other people. Some special devices can be used to overcome the disability. Then it becomes possible to carry out our own task independently. If we cannot see well, we can use spectacles. If we cannot see at all, we can make use of sounds or feel with the hands to get things done. You might have seen a blind person using a white cane. Blind people use a cane to feel the way in front of them. The sounds they hear around them also help them to know the situation around them. Thus, they can make their way independently even on a crowded road full of traffic. Overcoming disability. A person who cannot hear well can use a hearing aid. Those who cannot hear at all can use sign language. In some cases, a surgery can help a person to hear. If there is a defect in the leg, a special wheelchair can be used. Then the defect in the leg is no more a hurdle. Children, do you know Arunima Sinha, a young woman from Uttar Pradesh? Once, when she was 22 years old, she was travelling on a train. She had to fight off some thieves. She was thrown off the train. Another speeding train ran over her. She was seriously injured. Doctor saved her life, but they had to cut off her right leg. Many people would come to see her. Each person would worry about her future. But Arunima resolved that she would never give up. She would achieve something so extraordinary that no one could ever say she was helpless. Doctor gave her an artificial leg. As soon as she got to her new leg, she began to train for mountaineering. Just one year after her accident, she climbed one of the high peaks in the Himalayas. The very next year, she climbed Mount Everest, the highest peak in the world. Children, what can we learn from Arunima's story? From the story of Arunima, we can learn that we can make impossible things possible with the help of our confidence. Children, let us learn what we have learned today. When we work, we need to have coordination in all the tasks. Difficulties may arise due to lack of coordination. If any organ does not function well, we may face difficulties in doing our work. We must not give up in the face of difficulties. They can be overcome. Always remember, 
even if there is a disability in any organ, we can find a way out of that difficulty. We can learn to be self-reliant. Children, I hope you all have understood the lesson. Take care. Bye.